Immerse yourself in an extraordinary journey that unravels the personal and lifestyle intricacies of Luis Robert, the enigmatic star dominating baseball. Every hero has an origin story. Here's the beginning of Robert's phenomenal rise in baseball. Luis Robert Moiran Jr. was born in Ciego de Avila, Cuba, on August 3, 1997, to mother Miguelina Moran Centeno and father Luis Robert. Robert Robles. He has two sisters, but their names are not exactly known. It was in his hometown in Cuba that Robert first fell in love with baseball. The family Robert came from wasn't an all-around sports-savvy family, but he received as much support as he could get. No one can tell the story of Luis Robert's first steps like his mother. Her bond with Robert is thicker than glue. Let's rewind to when he was 11 years old. His mother narrated how his team was losing a provincial game and Robert had to turn up for them. He took his bat, joined the game, and hit a home run, which secured the win. How else can a young baseball player show the clutch in them if not through a crucial home run like that one? Robert's mother was the one who was impressed the most. She said it was at that time she knew he would become a great baseball player. She'd later proclaim, quote, he was born to do what he's doing. It was obvious Robert had a path to follow. That was the way of baseball. His career is already shaping into that of a young legend. But it all started with baby steps. The road to glory, Robert's ascent in baseball. In a world steeped in competition, Robert stood out. His journey to the top is a story worth telling. It wasn't easy at first as his mother worried a lot about how skinny and small he was. She revealed that her baby boy ate a lot of food his body betrayed him. Can you imagine that the Robert you know and love today was ever a skinny kid? Anyway, with time he started to put on some weight and with his family's support intact, Robert began his first steps to professional baseball in the Cuban Junior League. He started playing for their junior national team at a much younger age before his talent moved him real quickly to the Cuban Tier Nacional. He played for the Ciego de Avila in 2013 and had a bad hitting run of three hits in 24 shifts, recording just 125. But things became better the following year when he hit 244 in 2014, and then in 2015, his hitting shot up to 305. Then his hitting was 401 in 2017. That was quite a huge growth, wouldn't you agree? Anyway, after shining in Cuba, he defected to Haiti and later on to the Dominican Republic, where he was able to prove himself to scouts. It didn't take long for the Chicago White Sox to see the overflowing talent of Robert they needed to be fast, else other franchises would snatch him from them. Being fast is one thing, but they also needed a good amount of cash to make Robert pen down a contract. Even without playing a single game in the minor or major league, Robert signed a contract with a $26 million signing bonus with the White Sox. To further blow your mind, he was only 19 when he signed that contract. Talk about bagging a $26 million signing bonus at the age of 19. It was marvelous, and so was what was to come. First time Robert started as an outfielder in a spring training game, the White Sox knew they had a gem in their hands. They couldn't afford to lose it. In that game, he helped his team to a 14-12 victory over the Cincinnati Reds. Before appearing in a major league game, Robert penned down another contract with White Sox. It was worth a whopping $50 million. It's kind of mind-blowing the kind of contracts Robert received even before his first major league appearance. Perhaps it was all worth it when he finally did in 2020. In his rookie season, Robert batted 233 with a slugging percentage of 436 and went on to win the American League AL Rookie of the Month Award for August. And we can all admit that 2020 was a special year for Robert. He became the youngest player to record a homer in a postseason in White Sox history after a 487-foot home run. That wasn't all. He went on to win the Gold Glove Award for center field, 
But hold on, we didn't say young Robert was done yet, did we? Anyway, he missed out on the Rookie of the Season award, coming in second after losing to Kyle Lewis. In 2022, Robert hit his first career grand slam off a starting pitcher, and in 2023, he was named to his first ever All-Star game. Robert had earlier agreed to play the 2023 Major League Baseball Home Run Derby before he called it off due to injury. Injury has been a major weakness for Robert. Apparently, it was a major reason he changed his lifestyle. And for a celebrity athlete, Robert's lifestyle is rooted in baseball. Off the field, Robert's intriguing lifestyle. Behind the intense gaze and robust swings is a lifestyle that echoes his passion for the sport. Robert's lifestyle is heavily immersed in baseball. In fact, he rarely has time for family during the season. But outside the pitch, he tries to make the best out of it. In a vlog with the White Sox media team, Robert said he loves spending time at home and doing what he wants to do there. One could say Robert's primary hobby is spending time with his family. And they won't be wrong. During the vlog, he made it known that he had three months every offseason, and so he always tries to maximize his time well with his family. Robert also loves cooking and helping out in the kitchen. It's not every day you get to see something like that, huh? He purchased the home you see here specifically for himself and his family, and the house has everything you can think of. A movie theater, a huge swimming pool, a batting space, and even a basketball court. Robert has quite a close-knit family. They stay in the same house, eat at the same table, and even go to practice together. Besides this, there's nothing Robert has shown the world regarding his life off the field. He hasn't been caught partying or any other activity that befits his celebrity status. If Luis Robert's lifestyle fascinates you, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more captivating beats baseball stories like this one. A Legacy in Progress, Luis Robert's Influence on Baseball Robert's influence is far-reaching, influencing not only the game but future generations. It's undeniable fact that even Robert doesn't know the amount of influence he has on younger generations. The Chicago White Sox alone have felt the impact of this man. Both the management and fans know Robert is poised to become one of the biggest baseball players of all time. Also, the fact he came from a middle-class family in Cuba and made his way to the major league is already a big inspiration for many. Pedro Grafal, manager of the White Sox, lacked words to describe Robert's influence in the game. He simply said, If you're a baseball fan and you don't know who he is by now, you're probably not watching too much baseball. Robert's influence is already felt in the Chicago White Sox, no doubt. But for his people in Cuba, Robert is the man, the myth, and the legend. He has a godlike status back in Cuba, and it's not up for debate. Robert is a reflection of how boys and girls dream in Cuban. To conquer their local league and move on to the international stage. Words alone can't describe the amount of love and influence Robert exudes back in Cuba. From the local reporter to the average street person in Cuba, Robert is a hero. For someone who has a godlike status in his own country, Robert's day-to-day -day lifestyle is quite simple. Unplugging the superstar Luis Robert's everyday life. Robert is just one of us, after all. His day-to-day -day life is normal, part of the extreme routine athletes have to follow. His day starts with his personal trainer, who takes him to training every morning. Robert does many types of exercises, from cardio to weightlifting. Immediately after Robert is done with physical exercises, he moves to his personal baseball training ground. Together with his trainer, he practices different types of shots in preparation for any upcoming games. The next part of Robert's life is having lunch with his family. Peek into his family dining routine shows a happy family satisfied with their achievements. As he would always say, I believe family is everything. But aside from all we've shown you thus far, Robert's private life is an unknown world to an outsider. Perhaps it's a price he has to pay on his way to being a baseball legend. If you enjoyed this video about Luis Robert, check out the video on this screen now or the one we posted below because we're sure you'll like that one too. Let us know in the comments if there's another baseball player whose journey you'd like us to cover. See you there.